Hello everybody, I'm meteorologist Dan Drew with your weather on demand for UpperMichiganSource.com. We will manage to see a few showers today, but a cold front passing through will dry things out as we get into our day tomorrow. Unfortunately, that wet weather returns as we get into Saturday, so not the greatest weekend for outdoor activities. This morning, we are seeing a few scattered showers across Upper Michigan. Otherwise, actually a mix of sun and clouds at the 8 o'clock hour. And in the western UP, we did have some patchy, dense fog in some areas. That fog is now managing to mix out. That's the good news. We're also seeing these showers out ahead of a low pressure system just to our west. But we're also keeping tabs on a cold front that is separate from that low pressure system. That'll be dropping into upper Michigan later this afternoon into this evening. And we'll time some of this out for you because what's going to happen is, is as we go through the day, we'll see a few scattered showers, maybe even a few scattered showers along that cold front. Although a lot of those showers will manage to dissipate before they make it to us behind this cold front. We dry out and clear out and that's going to allow temperatures to really dip off overnight, especially away from the influence of Lake Superior and Lake Michigan. As we get into our day tomorrow, plenty of sunshine across upper Michigan with high pressure overhead and maybe a few clouds building into the western UP late in the day. But as we get into the overnight hours, we see a few more clouds before this next system begins moving in from our west. Saturday, it could be a bit of a wet day. Some of those showers that we'll see out ahead of this system could be heavy at times. Keep the umbrella handy. Unfortunately, not the greatest day for outdoor activities and the remnants of tropical storm bills should stay to our south. We're not too concerned about that for the rest of our day today. We'll see a few scattered showers. They'll be very few and far between and light in nature. Temperatures going to struggle to get to 60 degrees in areas near the Lake Superior shoreline, especially after the cold front passes through and we see our winds more out of the northwest at about 5 to 18 miles per hour. And we'll also be dealing with clearing skies after that cold front does manage to pass through overnight. Those clear skies are really going to allow temperatures to bottom out, especially in the traditional cold spots away from Lake Superior and Lake Michigan. Some temperatures could dip down into the mid 30s, meaning some patchy frost in those areas areas. Areas along the lake shoreline should stay in the low 40s overnight. So that is the good news. Now for your day tomorrow, plenty of sunshine. It should be a beautiful day across upper Michigan. Temperatures ranging from the upper 50s to around the low to mid 70s. And we initially see uh, the chance for a few clouds later in the day in the far western UP. Your TV six day forecast will be looking at rain moving back into the picture for Saturday and we dry out as we get into the middle of next week. Temperatures staying right around average for this time of year. Have a wonderful day.